Hey everybody, that's us Dave here from CompleteEvo3D.com. This is the uh, My UI version 1.11.11. Uh, this one features the 2.3.7 point, <coughs> Android gingerbread. Um, it's uh, a lot of the changes that went into this ROM aren't very different or ones that you would mostly notice. Um, the the ROM still runs really smooth. I was trying to download a theme to show you guys some of the uh, nice themes they have here because that's a big thing with my UI is uh, um, the themes they let you do uh, just download and install. Uh, trying to do a quick lin pack. Um, I realize now um, after looking into it the the reason this ROM doesn't have 4G. Uh, YMAX is because it's a uh, China made ROM that uh, they support a lot of phones um, but uh, they don't have 4G there so I guess there's not so much of a concern to have the 4G up I'm trying to download this why is it downloading all this other stuff Anyways, um, I'll download in a second. Um, it doesn't have the updated YouTube, which is kind of nice because the updated YouTube kind of sucks. Not all that bad, but it could be better. Um, this is a, a, a full overhaul on the system, as it, you can tell. It's not since they, they built this from the ground up. Um, a couple of the fixes they had had to do with uh, call problems and um, so I'm running here real quick 64 right now this isn't over 75 a while uh, this isn't overclocked um, it does run really fast though runs uh, smooth runs good games video um, didn't come packed with a whole bunch of stuff uh, just to have everything on your desktop that's what it basically came with uh, they did add the uh, sound into the beginning of it rebooting so I was trying to download this theme but it just it's taken me a while on 3G so um, and look at this uh, reboot log or uh, watch it reboot real quick see how fast it does and the starting animation I said I kind of went with a dark room and uh, to help with seeing the screen a little easier. You can see my screen just changed how bright that HTC light is. That was it. I added that kind of uh, music to it and that, that boot up animation. So as you can tell right there, the screen moves off, or the uh, reboot of this phone is really fast. Um, I do believe they fixed an issue with the uh, sound on it too. So, oh, I think I my audio turned all the way. Huh? Yeah. So you got all these uh, MIUI or MyUI equalizers and um, some pretty cool stuff. So I mean, it's like I said, they got some innovative ways. A lot of the times I read on their forums, a lot of people just can't help themselves from switching to this ROM or sticking with the ROM. Uh, they get the the idea they want to switch to a uh, Sense ROM, but they always come back to this one. So this is a really good ROM. It gets updated every Friday. And uh, usually, uh, like I said, they cover a lot of phones. So if you've thought about leaving the Evo 3D or still still having me subscribed or watching this and you don't have an Evo 3D, uh, it's likely they might even have your phone listed on there. So check them out, my UI. Thanks, guys. Hey, everyone. Just did a quick add-on. Uh, this new theme, you can kind of put your finger down on it and drag over to those. Um, pulls up the new theme on the phone. Um, as you can see here, I'm going to go ahead and turn my, this one's a little darker, bring the 
brightness up on that a little bit. I don't know if that helps, but so anyways, this is the new theme uh, that I downloaded, and you can tell from these icons, you know, uh, how they have all these different themes. <coughs> you can download, and I just downloaded that other theme, but they have all kinds of really cool themes on here, and this is the one I had just downloaded. Um, all new kind of icons there. The really cool ones for the uh, the main icons and whatnot. So really cool stuff. I I really suggest taking a look into it. If you feel bad, notice that my camera's been crap. I'm uh, pulled up uh, to see if anybody wants to help me try to replace my camera with something a little better. So uh, don't forget to subscribe and like that.